Okay, first, first and foremost, for sure, congratulations to uh, San Antonio. Um, it's a ton of disappointment over here for us. I think uh, the way you look at how the game went, um, I said before the game that we were going to need to impose our style a little bit to win the game, and I don't think we did that at all. I think, uh, you know, we played their style of soccer and, and not ours, and, and when that happens, you know, that's, that's what they do, and they're going to come out on top for it, and that's what happened. So I think, uh, you know, obviously – Maybe in a month, or in my case, probably in 10 years, I'll look back and be proud of it. But right now, it's just a lot of disappointment and frustration. It looked like after the early penalty, you guys kind of settled into the game. And then, you know, right there at the end of the half, there's another penalty. Just can you talk us through what you saw in terms of the game flow and, and maybe where this one got away a little bit? Yeah, I thought we we – we did do a good enough job of, of getting into the of getting a grip on the game really in terms of our possession and stuff until way too late in the first half. Um, the penalty, I mean, it's unfortunate, but again, we knew coming into the game we were gonna be you know playing against you know, uh, against a style that, that you know feeds on styles and, and tries to draw styles and stuff, and we did not do a good job of of uh, Kind of controlling that, um, so yeah, I, I think I thought we maybe got a little bit more of the ball that, like we wanted, kind of 35 minutes in or so. But for me, 35 minutes is too long. It should have been earlier. And then, uh, yeah, you know, we give up the goal at the end of the first half, which you just can't do, um, especially on a, on a set piece if you knew that they were going to be playing for. And that's what happened. You know, you mentioned how you might look back at this in 10 years, but just what are your immediate thoughts on on this group? and what you guys were able to achieve this year? I can't, you know, I hate, uh, sorry to do this to you, because I know that, I know that there's positives that people are going to take from the season, but, you know, right now, emotionally after the game, my immediate reaction is that we underachieved. I thought we had a great group of people and a great group of players, and for us not to, not to put out a better performance today and give ourselves a better chance to, to lift the trophy is, is very frustrating. Um, and I look at my I look at myself first. You know, I think, I think you know, in my opinion, the, the performance on the field from the players, you have to look at the captain and that's me. And, and I don't think I did it enough to, uh, to get everyone to the level that I need to do today. So, you know, I put my hand up first and foremost because the expectation was to win these games and, and we did not. So, you know, I feel I've let a lot of people down today. Anybody have any questions? If you want to raise your hand, uh, Eric, can go ahead. Yeah, Paolo, this, I mean, for all that the game was and for your disappointment and, and what you just said, it's also not the same team you play a lot of the season with. Uh, it's tough to come in. It's always a battle of attrition. Is this been a little bit worse from that standpoint than the other times you've been associated with, you know, when you came to the final from a health standpoint? As a team. Um, yeah, I think that there's, I think, again, there's no question uh, that, you know, we've battled with a lot of uh, more injuries this year and, and, and stuff like that. But again, you know, I, I don't say these things as a cliche throughout the year. And when I get in the media about we trust everyone in the locker room and everyone is brought here to do a job. I, I really don't say that as a cliche and, you know, oh, yeah, that's the, the mentality we want to have. I, I, I mean, it, I believe it. And whether I'm in the team, whether I'm out of the team, whether, you know, anybody, Anybody that has a contract with Louisville City is expected to be able to play and win these games. And uh, we didn't do that today. So, you know, did we deal with a lot more injuries? Yeah, we absolutely did. But that's that's football. And and, and there is no excuses at this club. There will never be excuses at this club. Not as long as, you know, not as long as the ownership's around and I'm around, there will not be excuses. So, yeah, it was a tough year. But, you know, we got this far. It was, it was one more game and then we did not perform well enough. 